台北市是一个国际城市呢，有宽广的视野，更大的包容力，更多的创意。所以我想，何不透过我们的包容力，来融入多元的文化，打破地域的环境，把最优秀的这些亚洲的亚裔的民族一起聚于一堂。来展演多国的料理。One well done. One well done is where? We have to go fast, huh? My man, where my man? Are you going? Are you going? I'm in control. Oven the side plate the top. Need then we share to half. Are you doing the whole dish there? Uh, either fine here or there. Well, I think we just keep it. But, you need this place. But why do we need that table then to do the hot? Why don't we just use both areas for hot and cold? Because you know we're gonna be running back and forth. Yeah. 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 好，这个。It's always a challenge doing events outside of your restaurant. If you go into that restaurant, every square inch is custom, so you're really out of your comfort zone. But that's part of the excitement, and that's part of the the challenge. Can you have the other one, maybe? No, uh, spacer? I don't need one corner, like a... That's not bad. Yeah. Every time I meet a guest, or I meet any other guest, 呃，人合作的时候，最大的挑战可能是在事前的呃准备工作跟协调吧。嗯，因为那个是我不拿手的。Garbage, fresh mousse, rubber bands. You have this. 
，对我们采购来讲，储储有菜单之后，我们先 review 所有的 list 里面的东西，确定他要的这些食材，我们的方向大家是一致的，然后我们才去做一些设计。呢、这个咧，你最紧要呢个点买嘅啫。嗱，啲牛肉咧，如果一粒粒，第二次你买咪得靓。我可以点化？系啊，两件衫变咗唔买。The size we you have for the cover dress, I think it's pretty similar the size, but definitely the texture. 这次的 Best of Asia 是把五个不一样的个体规划在同一个框架下面，并且一起去执行它。我觉得这是最困难的事情。Honestly, you don't need you don't need to set a table. What if what if Alvin, if I have two tables pick up together, like this table and this is it, this table and this table. We have two. We have two persons. Oh, two people, two persons. What about this thing? We have two. We have two persons. Wait, 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 hey. I'm talking. Mm. Shut the fuck up. <coughs> I have two people doing this. Okay. So two here. I have two people doing it. So I, I you know, I, we have two people doing it. They wait this way. It's gonna be very quickly. It's gonna be very soon. We've been practicing. 这次有跟不同的团队在合作，在沟通上是一个很大的难题。Yes. From restaurant and bread team, each of us, together with Olsen, have one section. A section may be this big table, it can be also this table. If you, you see that these questions were not been mentioned uh, on the press conference, so it's no air time, it is always air time. Not too long because you got the glasses and the plants. I don't want to be too stuck, so I want just one my nail, my nail. Show me your nail. Yes. Okay, your nail. Number two, Bianca. Eight. Ah. 三，很好。他很在意这这一条线，来，然后三起，从哪从哪先来看这一条线？那什么时机点要过来跟大客人打招呼？怎么来做自我介绍？然后记得要 introduce you w o r k fashion manager， 小娜，方瑞，呃，对，方瑞双 Andre， 李波，方瑞双 Andre。今天为您举办的晚宴呢，是由呃我们的新加坡团队江正仁主厨。You just may need to speak a little bit louder, because when the room is full and people talk, the noise level is going to be quite high. So in order for them to hear you and feel that you are confident, you need to speak louder. 一个用餐经验，呃，它不只仅仅是料理，它是整整个。呃，从头到尾的一个一个一个经验。这个是烟熏的杏仁马卡龙，那这个是檀檀檀香木的香气，那你可以现还有烟的时候，趁机享用一下。外场的跟客人的互动 m e s s a g e 的一个传递，这是很重要的。我们如何让呃 chef 的心意在制作这盘菜的一个用心，跟为什么要这样做，菜单背起来不很困难。你要必须要了解到每一道菜非常想要传达什么样的讯息给客人。Here, so guests can read right away that you memorize your your 
这个怎么跟客人解释？它是一个部位，呃，你吃烤鸡的时候，那个大腿旁边是不是就两块凹进去，像干贝一样的，有没有？两块在在腰后面，有没有？就是那个部位，但是在牛身上，用干的风筝先熏过，然后用再用自烧的方式把那个松针的那个油。出来，让这个香气是比较清爽的。今天晚上准备牛仔面，牛仔面，牛仔面，牛仔面，牛仔面，牛仔面，牛仔面，牛仔面，牛仔面，牛仔面，牛仔面，牛仔面，牛仔面，牛仔面，牛仔面，牛仔面，牛仔面，牛仔面，牛仔面，牛仔面，牛仔面，牛仔面，牛仔面，牛仔面，それをそうめんマヨネーズにしたんでこれをぐるぐるってちょっとかき混ぜていただけるとまるで麺を食べてるような感じで全体のおひたしがうまくその粘り気で口の中で僕が口の中でこんな世界が起こるだろうというものをそのように起こるように仕掛けがもうしてあるから僕があなたは誰ですかって言われたら、まあ、日本料理を発信していくものですと僕は答えたいっていう思いが。あります。料理っていうのは日本語で断りを測るって書きます。その断りなぜに対する答えを僕の中には。僕の料理を食べたことによって日本ってこんなに豊かな国なんだっていうことを僕を一番に伝えたいと料理が美味しいとかテクニックがすごいっていうことだけではなくってこういう食材がこのように出てくることができるっていうその日本の自然環境の豊かさを料理で表現した料理です。There's a lot of philosophies at work. I don't think it's one main philosophy.、Um, one of them is certainly that with cooking,、um, it's first a craft. It's a skill that you have to practice and practice and practice, and that practice never really stops. I think it's really important that chefs、um, spend many, many years training, constantly try to improve their technique. If only you can do those things, then you have opportunity to express something artistic. There are four different chefs, and I think the food that we do are, are, are very different.、So、we're all Asian, coming from different Asian countries, but、uh, I'm the only one abroad. So for me, it's more of an exploration of how the East and the West, and I think that's something that's.、Um, Very involved in the way we cook, and it's, it's very noticeable in our cuisine. Next. It's always very exciting for me to、um, do an event in Asia,、um, and mainly because our food is very heavily influenced with, with Asian ingredients and techniques. I'm always curious to see what the,、um, the response will be from、uh, primarily an Asian audience to see some of the ingredients that they're very familiar with reinterpreted or served in a very Western context.、Um, so I'm, I'm very curious and excited about that.
I think my philosophy in my cuisine and also in life is basically the same. And for me, it's balance. The balance between uh, new and old, the balance between comfort and excitement and, or innovation. Recap chicken has three components, uh, sesame oil, uh, wine, and soy sauce. So the soy sauce will be in the soil. It's gonna be in a martini glass, okay, with the uh, chicken skin, crispy chicken skin protruding from the glass. Uh, and in there will be a, a, a foam, maple shouting wine, ginger, green onions. I, I call my food extreme Chinese. I want to take them from the comfort level. I want to move it to the edge where they can tolerate and still recognize the dish and still remain comfort. Liaoli, it is my language. 嗯，那当你遇到不同样的人、不同样的事情，呃，你会用不同的方式去表现它。Hey, can I have a smaller one? It's too heavy. Sure. <音>在夜市就是一个生活方式，怎么用非常局限的食材、局限的预算？做一个色、香味各个层面达到一个程度，我想这个让我们有很多的呃启发，因为我们在寻找的就是怎么样在最局限的一个 condition 里面做最大的发挥。创造一道菜，呃，需要花很多时间去完成，需要花很多时间去。去消化，去了解它背后的含义。所以对我来说，我希望每一次带给客人的感觉是不一样的面向。他们还是希望把自己的作品，把最好那面呈现出去给人家。你看到是所谓每个厨厨他对他们自己的一个坚持。你们这么多那个 crust 给蛋不是吗？为什么是不收了？我一间你食咧，你一间你睇会食死人先啊！做咩食死？今日要公司，唔系我哋未试过，我唔系试，我未试。唔系今日我哋试过。所以你们知道什么菜是你们做啊？知道，知道。OK。Hey, hello guys. Uh, chef is on board. Hey, that's a rocket, guys. Okay, come on, let's go. One more.
I think chefs can be very competitive. We want to strive. We all want to be number one. But I think the harmony in that is we like to make people happy with our food. で其實我們在要求的東西是一樣的。我們的想法是一樣的。對食材的要求是一樣的。對空調的溫度是一樣的。這不會因為國籍或者是說料理的不同而有所差異。all right, Corey. It's a nice service. How is this? How is the taste? Service. I think it's good. Yeah. That's one of the things I love about working in a restaurant is because it, it involves so many people who are really committed to their work, coming together to make something happen. It's a very difficult environment, very challenging. Um, and it requires like-minded people who work very hard and are committed to uh, a common goal. And when you have a team dynamic like that, it's very rewarding. First time we in uh, Taiwan, but uh, great experience with amazing chefs. Uh, all nights were so different and with a lot of passion behind. <laughs>
，我很感谢这些团队给我的一些相助也好，呃，摩擦也好，都是给我看清楚整个事情的一个一个一个助力。我觉我真的觉得就是就是团队。我们都看到他们一最一致的地方，就是对于细节的要求。每一秒都要顾及到顾客的,的感受。我们在出差的时候，我的肉的方向一点点角度有点不对，他就说：“呃，那个 Andre Chef 就过来，就说 Oliver， 这个是上板的吗？你看一下前面。Oh, ”我 s h e f 就马上改，就调整那个角度，就整件事情态度，就是他只是认真做好一件事情。美食这种东西是一个无国界的东西，食材。对一个有创意的主厨是在创造一种艺术，希望每一个人吃过这一餐以后都有永久的 memory 吧。They bring their food, they bring their way to work, way to cooking, they give us some idea. From this, we start already to move. For me,、uh, it's not really good to copy exactly what they do. It's more interesting to take idea or how they cooking and make your own style. 观摩别人的技法，然后他们的技巧，然后一直到现在已经转为内化。台湾的餐饮开始有这个能力，自己可以来做所谓国际美食的一个水准。中国有句话说啊，“鼎中之变，精妙为先”。今天做菜这件事情，不是让食材从生的变成熟的，它里面有非常多的物理的、化学的、艺术的变化。舞刀弄残那个人到底有没有这个能力来演绎这个食材？消费者也要努力，懂得欣赏，愿意付出代价，你就有办法去鼓励这些厨师朝这个目标去前进。这个活动把我们带到一个新的境界，已经不再是一个呃亚洲品牌，你就只能做亚洲人做的事。而是亚洲品牌，你可以做国际的事情。